afternoon and welcome everyone. I appreciate all of you all taking your time out of your day for this important announcement. In a first for the university, today's announcement is being streamed live at georgiasouthern.tv. And I would like to thank everyone who's joining us online as well. The past week, Georgia Southern students had the opportunity to vote on three important proposed student fees. I'm pleased to announce that a record number of Georgia Southern University students cast their ballots this week. A record turnout. A record turnout of 9,390 students, nearly 55% of eligible student voters voted this week. And now for the results. First, a $25 fee to fund the expansion of Allen E. Paulson Stadium to add an additional 6,300 seats to include a new upper deck to students and the visitor side. 70.4% of voters voted yes to support this proposed fee. Second, for a $10 fee to support sustainability and green initiatives on campus, 74.7% of voters voted yes to support the additional proposed fee. Lastly, for a $75 fee to support a fee to fund Georgia Southern University's potential move up to the football bowl subdivision, the FBS. 61.2% of voters voted yes to support the addition of the proposed fee. All three proposed fees have been supported by majority of the voting students of Georgia Southern University. As I mentioned earlier, the university will now forward the proposed fees to the University Systems of Georgia Board of Regents for their review and consideration. The Board of Regents must approve any student fee before it can be implemented. If approved, the expansion fee and sustainability fee will go into effect fall of 2013. If approved, the FBS fee will not go into effect until Georgia Southern University is offered and accepts an invitation to join an FBS conference. Timing for implementing the FBS fee will be dependent upon when the university receives an, invi an invitation from an FBS conference. Thank you all for your time and go Eagles.